this is probably the most unique uh, piece that we've ever uh, had an inmate uh, do. Now, the medium is that's used is paper, either to, uh, toilet paper or paper towels and toothpaste. But when you look at this, this is so highly detailed of Christ on the cross. Now, this is about 10 years old, and, you know, you look at this, and this took a lot of time. Uh, it's uh, playing cards and dice. And, again, it's, you know, for the most part, it's uh, either uh, some type of paper and, and uh, uh, toothpaste. Uh, and we have dominoes. These are picture frames that are made, and it's, it's made from candy wrappers. Uh, and this one is, is, again, a lot of this is very detailed, and it takes a lot of time. I think it speaks of the amount of time when they're sitting in jail, and we provide a lot of programming. We provide a lot of things for inmates to occupy their time, but in a 24-hour period, they're still going to be uh, you know, sitting in their housing unit, sitting in their cell for a considerable amount of time, so they have... So they have, uh, uh, you know, the time to do this. Uh, this one was, this is a mask that one of them put together. Um, and picture frames are real common using, using the uh, uh, wrappers from, from different types of, uh, whether it's uh, Frito, uh, Frito bags or just types of uh, candy wrappers, but highly detailed. And I think what's unique is that one inmate being able to tell another inmate how to do that. I think that there's a lot of that type of going on. Uh, it, so it's just unique. I think a lot of the things here is one that's real distinctive, where you can see the it's a it's larger um, uh, it's the potato chip bags and again frames making into photo frames. And there was one instance where an inmate had made the picture frame, and, and they're allowed three photos in their cell, and he actually was using the picture frame uh, for one of the photos. The unfortunate piece is this is considered contraband. Uh, they're only allowed to hold on to certain things within the cell, within the housing unit. It's a safety issue, too, for staff. Uh, but as you can see, there's a lot of, uh, there's a great deal of talent that comes through the, through the jail in, in, in uh, form of our inmates. Uh, as sheriff, Obviously, you would uh, like to see them be constructive with this outside the jail and where we would not see them inside.